Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining us. The show brings you Major League Baseball on a Saturday night. It's the Philadelphia Phillies going up against the Colorado Rockies. With my partner Chris Singleton, I'm John Shump. And singing the big bat in the lineup so far this year, Ryan McMahon leads the team at OPS. So he's the guy that looks to slug and basically make things happen for them offensively. Just a machine in terms of production at the plate. He'll take his walks. He'll barrel up the baseball. He'll hit the ball in the gap. So he'll hit the Leading ball over the fence. So talk about a guy going good. Right. That's him right now. Right, and right. he's a bat that you want to stay away from if you're the pitcher. Yeah, he's definitely had a struggle so far this year, as ball. evidenced by that inflated whip. But he's going to have to find a way to limit the base runners, put his team in a position to win a ball game. Oh, yeah. So we know he's prepared. We know this guy one is a ball, competitor. And we'll watch how he works in this one. Swings and misses. It's a ball in two strikes. One ball, two strikes. Just off the outside part of the plate. It's a good take. Quantrill back to work. Light drive. Has it in for the out. Randy Marsh steps to the plate. Everyone knows you got to be careful here, Chris. He is the best OPS in the National League. Smoked on the ground a second. Rogers throws yeah. to first. Two up, two down. Batting third. The first base is number three. Bryce. Bryce. Two Harper. outs, base is empty. And digging in for Philadelphia, Bryce Harper. Hey, and there's a strike. Two one. outs, base is empty. Next hey, right. offering is in for a strike. I understand you want to try to gauge that guy's fastball, but you also have to be aggressive and ready to hit in your zone. One now you're in a tough spot. That one way outside. And a count one and two. And there's a ball. That That's one ball. misses. Full count now. Full count. Up the middle. And the Phillies are set down in order. So in now for Colorado, Brenton Doyle. Yeah. And a swing and a miss. 0-1. Oh and a pitch. And that's outside. outside. Oh. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Swings through that, and it's a strikeout. And one gone. Got a pretty rough start to this series for him at the plate. Three strikeouts in the first game yesterday. Another one right there. They clearly got a great plan for how to deal with this guy right now. Charlie Blackman batting with one down takes a strike. strike two. Swing and a miss. He was late. Oh, strike two. two. On the ground, right side. Stop. And two quick outs in the bottom of the first here tonight. Ryan McMahon steps to the plate. And first offering is fouled off. I love how he tracked the ball right there and was able to get through that fastball just a little bit late. Otherwise, it stays fair. I think if the top hand is a little stronger, same swing produces a home run. Foul ball. It stays nothing in two. Two down, nobody on. Got him looking. That's a strikeout. Rockies. Back here at Coors Field. Here's the third baseman, Alec Bohm. The pitch. Fought off foul. That one oh. missing inside. One, one. In the air, right field, Goodman. Sizing this one up, he's got it. And a quick out number one. This is Bryson Stock. It's been a tough stretch for him at the plate. Only two hits over the last five That's games. Just missed. Second inning here, no score. 
That misses. Oh. Ball two. There's a swing and a drive. And that gets down into the gap. Around first, heading for two. And it's a one-out double for the first hit of the game. Showed some really nice patience in that at bat. Worked himself into a good count. Just a solid swing right there. Caught it out front and ripped it into the outfield for the base hit. Those always feel great. Gunner in scoring position. And there's a rocket into the outfield. Headed for the plate. And they'll score first. It's one zip. Challenged him with the fastball right in the heart of the zone. He was clearly ready to jump all over it. One out, runner at second. Here's Nicholas Castellanos, one of the stars in the win yesterday, as he had three hits. Up the middle, and that's off the second base bag. And no throw. He's into first easily. JT Real Muto steps in. Having a nice season in the power categories. Eighth in the National League in home runs as of today. Foul ball there. Quattro back to work. Into center. Montgomery gets under it. And he makes the catch. Runner tagging from third. To the play. He's safe. And they lead by two. There you go. Nice little RBI there. It's a great at bat. Got the job done. Johan Rojas getting ready to hit. Singing he's never finished the season with more stolen bases in his entire career. Base hit. Throw stops the lead runner at second. Two on and two out. Right there does a great job of staying in the big part of the field. Man, there are a lot of hits there. So the batting order turns over, and the batter will be the shortstop, Trey Turner. And that one fouled off. Two outs. Swing and miss as he was out front. No ball, two strikes. And ball. takes low for ball one. Back to right. Goodman under it. Makes the grab. And that is that. But two runs for him, and they jump ahead. Now to the bottom of the second. It's the Phillies two and the Rockies nothing. Bottom of the second. Here's the Rockies cleanup hitter, Ezekiel Tovar. In there at the knees. It's 0-1. Well, after scoring runs, this is where you're looking for that shutdown inning. Get that hot team back in there to swing the bats. High fly ball out to center field. Rojas hauls it in, and there's one away. And now it's Elias Diaz. Right through there for a strike. Well, I don't think anyone was surprised to see Nola have success in the majors. He was a star in college playing for LSU, becoming a finalist for the 2014 Golden Spikes Award. He's one of the top what? amateur baseball players in the country. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. Two away. Off to a strong start, Singy, as he's punched out three of the first oh, five he's faced. Well, he's definitely minimizing contact. He can get the swing and miss when he needs it, but he'll also keep the defense fresh behind him, allowing some balls in play as well. Got him looking for the K. One, two. Back here in Denver, here's the left fielder, Brandon Marsh. And a pitch. That one misses ball, the no zone. Strike. Ball one, Marsh. In his third season, 26 years old. What a run over the last 10 as he's hitting over 400 during that span. And that's a base hit. And the leadoff man aboard. He's been swinging it really well lately. Other than ripping one into the gap or blasting one over the wall, there aren't a whole lot of hits that are more satisfying than a nice line drive in the center field. So oh. that definitely felt good. Harper stands wow. in here, leaves that one off the inside. And a foul ball. And a 1-1. One, one. 
And that one hammered back there. And that one is gone. Home run number 20 on the year. And they add on. It's 4 nothing. He absolutely feasts on right-handed pitching and devours that one for a homer. And you can see that's what he expects of himself. At bat after at bat, he's that confident. That's exactly the pitch he was looking for. Crushes it and hits it out of the ballpark. Now it's Alec Bohm. Flied to right his first time. Pitch misses. Oh. 1 0. Can be tough to bounce back after a big home run, but nobody on, nobody out. You just have to treat it as a fresh inning. In the air, right field. Goodman makes a nice grab at a full sprint. Now it's the second baseman, Bryson Stock. It's a good recovery, though, after giving up the home run. Not allowing it to stay in the head, but going to work at the next hitter, and a tough one at that. One down, base is empty. Left field on the move. And it's caught for the out. Kyle Schwarber comes up to hit here. Swinging a foul straight back. Two runs across in the inning here in the second game of the series. Oh, and two now. Battling here as he fouls it away. Two down, nobody on. That misses no, that the miss. zone, that's the ball. and that's ball one. Spoils the two strike pitch, and he'll see another. Two outs. Swings and misses. Couldn't catch up to the heater. But two come across to score in the inning, courtesy of this two run homer. It's now a 4 0 ball game. Major League Baseball is on the show. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Now it's the rookie first baseman, Aaron Schunk. And that's in there at the knees. Late on that fastball. Oh, this can be kind of frustrating for the hitting coach. Right now, this lineup seems to be swinging at everything. Here's the 0-2. Keeps the at-bat going with a foul ball. The wind of the pitch. Swings and misses, struck him out. Well, he's got great strikeout stuff on the mound, doesn't he? I mean, double-digit strikeouts good. in his last no start, and he's just racking them up uh -huh. again in this one. This guy can really uh -huh. dominate a game out there. Uh -huh. Not a fun assignment for any lineup. Hunter oh, Goodman in the box now. No balls and a strike. Next offering in there for a strike. And it's nothing in two. One out, base is empty. Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. And the 2 Stays alive. Headed down the line. Castellanos on his horse. Won't get to this one. It drops foul. Fights that one away. The count remains 0-2. Five foul balls in a row. I have no idea what that feels like, but you got to love this battle. I'm just wondering who's going to blink first. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. Came inside with that two strike fastball nicely and just bunched him up on the inside part of the plate. Couldn't get around on it and catch it out front. 
Many times if you do, it's a foul ball. And you know a lot of pitchers, they really don't like working inside with two strikes because they do not want to hit that batter. And when they've got him up against the ropes, got to figure out a way to put him away. Did a nice job right there. The Rockies down by four here in the last half of the third. Got him swinging. And welcome back to the ballpark. And now the right fielder, Nick Castellanos. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Well, these Phillies doing a good job of putting the ball into play, and that makes things more challenging on the defensive right. side. And here's a stat for you, Brew. They're making one contact one. with more than 85% of the pitches that they're swinging at. It's pretty special stuff. Not so good if you're out there on the mound. And right back to the mound. Tosses hey. the first. One up, one down. And up to the plate is JT Real Muto. Lace down the line. Could be extra bases. Around first and hustling for second. And that's a two bagger. Everything came together for him. Nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters, they take so many reps in the cages working on going to the opposite field, and it doesn't always translate into the game, but right there it did, and he did it perfectly. Man at second. Pitch misses ball. there, and that's ball one. Meanwhile, activity in the bullpen. Kyle Freeland, the lefty, looks to be getting himself ready. Up the middle. Roll picked out of the dirt, body save. That's why you run hard 90 feet. Take nothing for granted, especially when you've got great speed. I'll take the infield knock. Here's Trey Turner. Hit on the ground, might be two. To second for one. Double play. What a great killing to end the inning. So and we're back. And here is Brenton Doyle. And that one is lifted in the air. Marsh on the move. And there's one away. He was all over that first pitch fastball. Just barely missed it. Man, this guy was ready to hit. Blackman batting for the second time. And that's strike one. Knocks that one away, and we'll do it again. The Phils leading by four. We're here in the bottom of the fourth. The punch out there. Two gone now. Well, he throws him with the changeup right there, and I think he was so geared up for fastball. Once he recognized that it was off yeah. speed, he just wasn't able to make an adjustment. So a really good strikeout, and pitcher just won the battle. Swing and a miss. And that is strike two. Oh, two. And that That's one missing low. One, two. And a ball and two strikes. And down on strikes. And good work there as he gets a one. The pitch. Swing and a ball lifted left field on his way over. Nabs it. And there's one away. And now here is Harper. Almost a loud start to the inning on that first pitch. Man, he's going to want that one back, no doubt. Swing and a miss, strike one. Just a strike. little too quick on that front shoulder, front hip, front foot. Everything comes open. No way of making contact with that one. One down, base is empty. Swings and misses. And that's strike two. Well, he went inside a couple of times, and now outside, there's not exactly sure where to look for this next pitch. And a swing and a miss. That's out number two. Two outs, base is empty. So digging in now for Philadelphia, Alec Bohm. That First miss, offering and it just misses. Two down, nobody on. And we're at the top of the fifth. Swing and that ball smashed on a line. Brings it in, and that is that. Back here at Coors Field, bottom of the inning. So in now for Colorado, Ezekiel Tovar. Ground ball to the right side. Stott nope. over to first in time. And that's the first out in the bottom of the fifth. And a foul ball. Here comes a pitch. 
That ah. one finds the zone. 0 oh and 2. That's foul off to the right side. Keeps the AB going. And the pitch. Gets a piece and stays alive. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And there's two away. Now at 10 Ks with still a few innings left. So expect him to add on to that total. And you know, pitchers are looking right. to have a strikeout for inning. I mean, that's no excellent one. work. Uh, the way it looks now, I mean, he's going to have a better rate than that in this yeah. one. So really good stuff working on the mound in this one. Two down, nobody on. Swings and misses. And it's a three up, three down inning. Kyle Freeland comes on now. Bringing in the lefty with the left-handed hitter coming up to hit. Classic bullpen move right here, so we'll see how it works out. Why to kick the pitch. Bounced up the middle. In plenty of time to first, and that's one out as they get the leadoff hitter in the sixth. Really nice job to get your first out of the ball game. And that one fouled off. Schwarber, multi-time All-Star, 31 years old. He's knocked in nine over his last 10 games. Liner, base hit. So they get a man aboard with a one-out single. Another multi-hit game for him. He's been really hot lately. Pretty much a model swing on that one as he ripped it into the opposite field gap. And I'm sure he's going to be watching that one back on video because that's the kind of swing you want to follow. with so many positives that led to that knock. Man at first, one away. And he deals. Wouldn't oh. chase that time. Huh? Got him swinging. Nice job behind the plate there. You hear people talk about letting the ball travel so often in terms of a hitting approach, and that's a great example why right there. If he's willing to let that curveball get a little deeper into the zone before he commits, he's way more likely to recognize that it's making a beeline for the dirt. Well, we'll hold that thought as that's the third out. Staying in the game on defense, Edmundo Sosa. He entered the game to pitch hit, and now man second base. And there's a foul ball. And the pitch. Hey. Swing and a miss. And the count is 0-2. 0-2. This one in the air center field. Makes the catch, and there's one gone. Hunter Goodman digging in for the Rockies. And first offering is fouled off. And the righty deals. Strike two. I think he was sitting off speed there. Going to. Got him. That's out number two. Oh, there's a three-pitch strikeout. He can do whatever he wants with the baseball right now. Montgomery, oh. the next to hit, takes ball one. That's in for a strike on the outside corner. And the count one and one. On the ground. Trey Turner gloves it. He is safe. And that was bang, bang at first. So up next, Brenton Doyle. Breaking ball in there for a strike. He might want to steal second in this spot, but he's dealing with a catcher that has one of the best pop times in the game. He needs to pick his spot very wisely. And a good eye there. And that no, misses that off the outside edge. The Rockies down by four here in the bottom of the sixth. To second, That's Turner gets him easily, ends the inning. And welcome back to the ballpark. Here's the center fielder, Johan Rojas. That one, one in the dirt. Out. Ball one. Action in the pen down there. Number 43 getting ready to come on for Bud Black. Lawrence getting loose as well. On a line, base hit. 
just kind of slice that one into center. Back to the top of the lineup. Trey Turner now. Run around the goal. Strike in there. Throw the second great jump. Late swing fouled off. And that's That's outside the and the count is one and two runner in scoring position nobody out here at the top half of inning number seven in the air center field Montgomery makes his way towards it makes the grab on the run and there's one down now that so digging in Brandon Marsh one for three So they're making a move for a bat off the bench. Austin Hayes. He gets a chance with a runner in scoring position and one gone. Puts it in the air out towards left center. And that'll fall for a base hit. Around third. Fires it to the plate. And he's out. Here's Bryce Harper. He's already homered in this game. And that one is in for a strike. Runner at second, two down. Here in the second game of the series. Comes up empty, that's strike two. He finds himself in a tough situation early. Just kind of trying to simplify it. Take a knock the other way if you can. Found a miss, struck him out. That ends the frame. So remaining in the game defensively, Austin Hayes. He'll be the new left fielder after entering the game as a pinch hitter. Blackman stands in now and watches strike one. That's towards center. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there's one down. The third base is number 24. Next to hit for the Rockies, Ryan McMahon. McMahon. That one finds the zone. Strike one. Base is empty one away. Here at the bottom of the seventh. Late swing. Foul to the left. Fights it off. You'll see another. The pitch. Gets a piece and it stays 0-2. Clobber to right field, way back, gone! That one felt good. His seventh home run of the season. It's 4-1. So good at getting his arms extended, and that's exactly what he did right there. You don't typically want to pull a pitch in that part of the plate, but he doesn't allow his wrist to roll over, stays through the ball, gets the loft, and gets the home run. So one out, nobody on. Ezekiel Tovar digs in now. And there's the strike. 0-1. On the ground, right side. Steps on first for the out. Next for Colorado, Elias Diaz. That nice one's in one. there, and that's strike one. This nice ball for a strike. Two outs. No, that's down. Excellent oh. arm action on that two-strike changeup. Just missed. Man, he wanted that call. Foul ball still, one and two count. The line of the pitch. Headed towards the corner. And that will end the inning. But not before they're able to draw closer with this blast. It's now a 4-1 ball game.
Welcome back and a new arm of the match. Start the eight, number 43. Pretty tight game, so they're looking for quality pitches out of him right here. Got to do his best to keep the score right where it is. Rogers throws the first. Leadoff man is out here in the eighth. And here is Sosa to the plate. Good late bite on that slider. Got the hitter out in front, rolled over on it. Exactly what he was supposed to do. Makes the catch for the out. And there's two down. Two outs, base is empty. Kyle Schwarber, the next to hit. Yeehaw. Swing and a miss at one above the zone. Activity in the bullpen. Number 41 getting loose out there. And that's, no, that's off inside. the inside edge. And it's one and one. Two down, nobody on. And we're in the top of the eighth. That one is absolutely belted. That's back there. Got all of that one. A gigantic blast. Home run number 20 on the year. It's 5-1. That was blasted. Absolutely. No doubt off the bat. They thought he could blow a high fastball by him, but he was ready for it. Look at how quickly he jumped on that pitch. away with nobody on. Now it's the right fielder, Nick Castellanos. Swing and a ball lifted in the air. Left field, pretty well struck. Doyle reaching back towards the wall. Pulls it in on the warning track. The Phillies add another on this solo homer. It's now 5-1. You're watching Major League Baseball on the show. Bottom of the eighth. Here's the second baseman, Brendan Rodgers. Fastball oh, yeah. for a strike. Hey. And that's in for a strike. Quickly in an 0-2 hole, you're going to have to give something up here in terms of power if you want to put the ball in play with any authority. And down on strikes he goes. One down. And there's another strikeout, and those are just continuing to pile off. His yeah. confidence level has got to be dropping. He's got to find a way to make an adjustment, dude. Get back on track. His team needs him. Right and that's in for a strike. And he is just dialed in right now. Every pitch thrown with so much conviction. Right. The punch out there, two down. A big performance on the mound. Lots of strikeouts. That was number 14. Yeah, clearly trusting his stuff in this one, ah. Feeling really good about what he's working with. And oh, one. that really allows a guy to attack hitters. You know, such an important mindset to have out there on the mound, especially when you're ahead in the count with two strikes. Pitch oh. misses, and it's one and two. The Rockies down by four. Here the bottom half of the eighth inning. Now this one's crushed down the line. Looking foul ball. Oh, he's ready for that fastball right there. Really turned on it, hit it hard at the distance. Just three. Now oh, that's strike three and the third out. And we're back now. JT Real Muto. And the right hander back to work. Bounced out to short. Tobar tosses the first. Now one gone in the ninth. And now for the Phillies, Johan Rojas. Base is empty one away here at the top of the diet. Up the middle, Tobar gets it to first. And a couple of quick outs. Here's Turner now. Hammers that one deep left field and forget it. A massive home run. That's his third home run of the series. It's 6-1. That's their third home run of the game. They're having a lot of fun at the plate in this one. They've got the long ball working for them on autopilot. 
So, Singy, this is a little bit of a surprise. A guy known for line drives hits one over the fence. Well, if you're a little too early, you'll get some elevation and the ball will get out of the ballpark. For him, it's kind of a mistake. But you know what? When you have such a good approach. Now, number 41 taking over on the mound. I think it's got to be a little tough right. coming in out of the pen when your guys are trailing so big on the scoreboard. Just doesn't have the same intensity ball, to it. Great. But he's got to find a way because these batters count the same for his stats, obviously, regardless of the score. That smash towards center. Montgomery makes the grab, and that's the third out. But the solo shot stretches their lead even further. And this is now a 6-1 ball game. Back here in Denver, last chance for the home team. And now, Benny Montgomery swings through that one for strike one. I mean, his pitch efficiency, ability to get ahead and count, at times pitch to contact, let the defense work behind him. That's why he's still in the game here in the ninth inning. The 0-2. And a foul ball, he stays alive. You just don't see it that much anymore. A guy being this efficient and getting this deep into the game. I wonder if he's going to be able to close it out. There's just something about that ninth inning. But being at under 100 pitches, he's still got plenty of fuel left in the tank. He came out of his mechanics there. Typically likes to shoot the ball the other way. But that time, a little anxious. Out of bounce right side. Sosa. Low throw and he can't take it out. The bad guy. Here's Chuck Nasty, 0 for 3. A fly out of ground out and a strikeout. Warm burner into the outfield for a knock. Quick throw back in. Lead runner holds it second with one gone. Ryan McMahon digging in for the Rockies. And a breaking ball drops in for a strike. And that's a strike. Runners at first and second with one gone. Here the last half of inning number nine. Bows that off to the left and will do it again. And That's downstairs. Down. Really close pitch down around the knees there. And you could see him asking where no, it that missed. That's the ball. Probably doesn't agree, but it appears he's ready to move the on to the next pitch. Strike. Swing and a drive, deep right field. That's bad. That one is good. Another homer. His second home run of the game, and they cut into the lead. It's 6-4. He kept swinging, and it paid off. Well, that was a battle, Boog, and he just kept taking his cuts. Finally squared one up. Looks like this guy was looking out over the plate, but he was ready to turn on the inside fastball. So direct to the pitch, absolutely blasted out of this ballpark. Next to hit, Ezekiel Tovar. Edge yeah. of the zone for a strike, and it's 0-1. Already three runs across in the frame. We're in the last half of the ninth inning. Ground ball, left side. Fires across the diamond, and there's two away. A couple of pitches and a quick out. Diaz, oh. the next to hit, takes One outside. Out. Two-run game, a two-away here in the bottom of the ninth. On the ground, and this should do it. Guys, and he can't hang on. No play, that's an infield single. One out away from this game being oh, over, but an infield single that's keeps them alive. They're still yeah. breathing, and maybe this provides that's that last-minute spark. Rodgers at the plate now. That's ball one. In there at the knees for a strike. That's off the mark. Two and one. The tying run at the plate. And a swing and a miss there. The Rockies down to their final strike. And a swing and a miss. And that is the ball game. Well, what a gutsy performance. He saved the bullpen. Gave him the day off. He wasn't super dominant, but he found a way to pitch. And when guys don't have their best stuff, inning after inning, 
throughout an entire game, you see them dig deep and they pitch. And that's exactly what he did to get this win today. And this one ends with a final score of 6-4. to four. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Shambi. We'll see you soon.